Good morning, partners. Howdy, ma'am. And welcome to The Roundup, a very special show on Hunky Dory TV, uh, where we take a look at some of the recent launches we've brought to you, and we bring some items that have gone out of stock because they've sold so well back into stock. That's right. Now, my name is Sheriff Dan, and I am the law enforcement around these parts, uh, but I'm not alone in my law enforcement. No, we also have the very talented Emily Deputy, Emily Ralph. Mm, howdy. Howdy. How are you? I didn't know what to say, she says. Now, Hunky Dory Town is a law-abiding town. We, we run a very tight ship around here, although it's not a ship, it's a town. Yes, we do. Uh, but every now and then, an undesirable passes through town. That's right, an undesirable. They could be rustling cattle. Mm-hmm. They could be fighting in the bars. They could be eating everybody's, far more than their share of everybody's Christmas chocolates around the office. <laughs> This is true. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we have caught one such, un one such undesirable, and they are languishing in the demonstration station jail. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to Natalie Badmouth Musprat. Morning, Badmouth. Morning. Morning, I got a morning out of Badmouth. That's amazing. I didn't think you were going to speak. I wasn't, but then you just told everyone that I've been eating the chocolates in the office. <laughs> and I don't think that's very fair. You did eat more than your fair share. The, you put them on the desk. I next did put to them me. on the desk. This is very, very it's true. Your fault. Good normally, morning, everyone. Normally you have to flash a bit of Galaxy Miri at Natalie to get her to speak. Damn. Damn, that's good. And it is good. <laughs> okay, now Natalie is in jail for three reasons, people. Three. Three reasons. Number one. Rustling cattle through the town square without permission and not cleaning up after them. I stood in that. That was terrible, <laughs> Natalie. She made a right mess. Number two, stealing my spurs three times in the last week. They're my spurs. They go on my boots, not yours. Apologies. Ooh, I'm mad with it. Apologies. That's good. It's going well. <laughs> Number three, occasionally using liquid glue on Miri card. <sighs> oh. Major faux pas. We know that. Okay, now Natalie is in jail, and fairly so. We all know this. There is only one way she can get out of jail, and that is with the Kingdom of Freedom. Woo! <laughs> Emily? Ooh. That's right. The Kingdom of Freedom is the only way that she can get out of jail. But the only way she can get the Kingdom of Freedom is by you guys voting for her to get the Kingdom of Freedom. That is right. Natalie is going to do three demonstrations for us today. One, two, three. After each one, you are going to vote, kindly vote, in the comments, uh, either on YouTube or on Facebook, whether it should be Free Nat or Bad Mouth. Free Nat or Bad Mouth. I think it's Bad Mouth already. I've already heard you say damn today. Damn. Damn. See, she, I love your new moustache, Natalie. I know. I've gone, um, I, I, so I've grown this over the last two days. Yes, yes. Um, but I decided to just keep it its natural colour, like normally, because, you know, us men, we, we have to dye, it, dye our beards sometimes. Yes. So I thought I'd keep it au naturel. That's au naturel. So this is the normal, <laughs> this is yeah. the normal colour, is it? It's, um, it really suits you. It matches the uh, the trim on your hat perfectly. I know it kind of um, g goes together really. It does nicely, go together. It? It's actually is it? Ha it's hairy. It is. It's an amazing moustache. I'll get my comb out later. Hey, eh? Gillette, the best bad mouth can get. It's very true. <laughs> She'll get a comb out later. Uh, okay, guys, a little bit of due diligence as usual. Uh, mm. Win it weekly. Mmm. What are we giving away? We're giving away a Woodland Wildlife Topper Collection. Uh, this features illustrated woodland animals. It's worth £19.99. There are going to be five winners. When are they going to win? Bad mouth? Today! Are, today! They're going to win today. <laughs> she's, she's there. She's there. Five winners. We're going to give it to, away today. So, to be in with the chance of winning one of these, what we need to know is this. How many cards are sent on Valentine's Day each year? Is it A, 170 million? Is it B, 145 million? Or is it C, 120 million? That's a lot of cards. That's a lot of cards. 145, 170, or 120. 
please put your answer into the comments. Uh, one of those one of those is correct, isn't it, Anne? Yeah. She's not tricking us, it's true. We will give you the answer to the question uh, later on in the show, and we are going to pick five winners. All you have to do is comment, give us that answer. People have been commenting throughout the week on the shows, they've been commenting on the hub. Five people are gonna win it, they're gonna win it today. Okay, that's number one. Uh, what else do we need to tell people? Throwback Thursday. Did you see your email yesterday? If you are in, if you um, if you're in the Club of Kidori, if you've entered your email or joined our newsletter, you get an email through probably every day. Um, yesterday's was about Throwback Thursday. It's about just a note, the just a note luxury topic collection. Seven pounds ninety nine instead of nineteen ninety nine on Throwback. Isn't that amazing? Do we have one? We do. Should we take a very very quick look through it? Yeah, let's do that. Now, we're not demonstrating this today, are we not? Yeah. Oh, we are oh, demonstrating this. Oh, we'll do this in. one first. Should we do this first? Let's do, do it. it. Here we go. So, are we ready? So, with our Just a Note um, collection, you get automatically an inspiration sheet, as you would expect. Then you get f four topper sets, and you get two of each of them. Okay, this is perfect for people who like writing, uh, people who like journaling, um, it's people who like the People who like the time, and who doesn't like the time? <laughs> it's got a gorgeous gold foil, lovely borders, lovely multiple borders as well. Foiled and die cut, you press it straight out. Sentiments everywhere, lovely jubbly. Love these, um, uh, the, the notebooks at the bottom, the drawing books and so on. Very pretty, the ink well, there's keys in here. Um, very, very pretty. If I can move on to the next one, there we go. This is on our Maptastic cardstock. Move it that way, Daniel. Yay, we got it. This is on a matte-tastic cardstock, so 350 GSM adorable scorable, but with a matte feel. Oh, it's beautiful, isn't it? So you can uh, you can stamp on this. You can die cut it, obviously, there's loads you can do. Uh, look at the pile of books there down at the bottom. Love reading. Are you a reader, Em? I am a reader, yeah. Are you a reader, Bad Mouth? No. No? No, it's terrible, isn't it? Bad Mouth isn't a reader? It's terrible. Probably the, the closest thing I get to reading is instructions. Honestly? Yeah. Is that because you, you're just not a fan of reading, or is it...? Possibly I just don't have time. <laughs> you can read, though. Oh, yeah, I can read. Okay, just check in. <laughs> She's an outlaw. She's I an can't outlaw. Spell. She I can't, can't spell, This is. I can read. We know that's true. We know that's true. <laughs> She's an outlaw, mate. I don't know. Um, okay, very, very nice. Uh, love these books up the side there. So trim those out, bit of fussy cutting. Uh, there's a lovely foil border here. Love the colours in this. It's sort of a beautiful pastel, isn't it? It's a very relaxing kit. And typewriter. Very nice. Very nice. So there's loads in this. You get two of every single sheet that I'm showing you. Two. two of every single sheet that I'm showing you. And instead of £19.99, this is £7.99. Uh, it's only while stocks last, though. Um, everything we do here at Hungidori Graphs, every, in fact, every, that's a bit of a strange thing to say, that, isn't it? While stocks last. Everything you buy anywhere is while the stocks last. Anyway, giving the game away there, I'm kind of you? giving the game away. That's the, that's the truth across the world, really. Unless they restock it, it's going to be out of stock. Um, we also have our Just a Note uh, little, it's not a little book, our Just a Note 8x8 paper pad. 48 sheets in here, 150 GSM. Using that gorgeous artwork, pretty backgrounds, perfect for you to work, use with your topper collection or indeed on its own. You're going to get six of each sheet here, multiple sheets of each. So you can fussy cut these, you can um, you can decoupage these, uh, no problem. Love this though, the paper, the papers are gorgeous in here now. They are absolutely stunning. Um, they look are beautiful <gasps> to fussy cut um, and add your parchment on here. They are obviously on that matte so if you want to add stamps to this you can do. Um, but it's stunning. I also really like how the patterns are on the back side of all of these sheets as well because you could just pick one out, um, trim the other side down just slightly, um, add a little sentiment and you're ready to go. It is a collection that does not need a lot of work mm. because the work is all there for you. It's very, it's nice. very nice and rustic, isn't it? But in a clean way as it well. It is, isn't it? Which is lovely. £4.99 instead of £9.99 on our Just A Note paper pad. Uh, we've got some parchment in this collection. We've got some inserts. I'm not going to show you those inserts, um, just from a time perspective, because there's a lot for us to go through today. It is a, f it has a sticky note. Four designs, times four of each. So this is normally that says the paper pad on screen, but this is um, parchment. You're going to get 16 sheets in here. Um, oh no, you know you don't you don't get four designs, four of each. You get four designs, two of each. Apologies, um, and it's one pound ninety nine instead of four pounds ninety nine. Look at that though, isn't that lovely? Big fan of parchment. 
Uh, Semi-translucent, as you can see. So we just put a, a sheet of white card behind so that you can see it easier. Um, look at the books. All stacked up. Now that is perfect for me because I love reading. You're good at reading, aren't you? I saw... Um... Oh, you're good at reading. No, I love that. No, I, love I mean, that. like, you're, in your household, you like reading. Family, family reads. Family read. It's family reads do, don't they? Cause a the, lot. The boys are reading Harry Potter. Or is it just Max? The, uh, no, Max is reading Harry Potter. Uh, Ellery's on the last Harry Potter. Okay. Max is on the second to last Harry Potter. So he's on the Half-Blood Prince for the people who love Harry Potter. He's doing well. Debs is rereading the Half-Blood Prince. We've got two copies. Debs is rereading the Half-Blood Prince at the same time as Max is reading it oh, so that they can talk so about cute. it and stuff, which is really, really cute. Like a little new house book club. It is a little bit like a book club, yeah. But Kindles are an amazing thing, aren't they? We used to have so many books. We, we um, gave some books to charity recently because we had so many books, but now with the Kindle, it's like all the books on this thing some technology is incredible uh, okay there is also a stamp in this collection oh my gosh this is beautiful uh, it's a thing of beauty it is a just a note a4 stamp set 16 quids worth of a4 stamps in here six pound 99 they're the designs that you get in it. So it's really nice, this. So, it's stunning. Uh, cards for just a note. Yeah. Uh, a perfect birthday cards for readers and so on are perfect. Um, really pretty. Let's go across to Bad Mouth and let's see whether she can get some free nat or Bad Mouths. Okay, so we're going to start off with the Life is a Story topper. So I've got my um, topper here. I've got my card stock here. I'm debating a little bit on what to do because I know what my back I want my background to look like, but I'm not sure about the what's going to fit in here. So we're going to start off with setting up that background first of all. We've got an eight by eight card blank and a mirror mat, which is going to sit on top. And then with my cardstock, we're going to cut this to um, two notches below the eight, so seven and seven eight. And the same again, so it's nice and square on this way. Then I'm going to take my trimmer and trim along this line here up to that book. And the best thing about this trimmer, like I always say, is it has little notches so you know exactly where to go to, where your blade is, so you don't cut any extra off. Then I already started doing a little bit of fussy cutting to save some time. Um, so I've just cut up to these books here. And I'm going to carry on around um, this beautiful foliage. Um, you don't have to be super tidy with this um, because it does have a kind of rustic feel to it anyway. So if you do trim or chop anything off that you necessarily didn't want to, um, don't worry. I took off the top of this watch here because I thought it wasn't fully necessary. So I've got up to that point here and then you have this beautiful sort of rip line and um, so I'm going to follow that and I've found a way recently to kind of get your rip lines where you want them to be and it's quite useful so I'm going to share that with you. I put my page onto my trimmer, let's move that so it's more in shot, put my page onto my trimmer and I line it up to this edge here and then what you can do is just move your cardstock along that edge because this is um, adorable scorable it is a bit harder to do that with um, but then you get like a sort of perfect sort of more straighter edge so if you want to keep it straight and sort of in line but you're still wanting that rustic feel you can do that and then you get that nice edge here so we're going to put that to one side and this as well and then I'm going to get this parchment because it is beautiful and we're going to cut this down so it's a little bit smaller. So I'm going to do this at I just love seven, seven inches. So this is going to fit in the middle. Guys so at seven. home, if you haven't had nice parchment seven. yet in your life, uh, you need to get some parchment in your life. It is stunning. It's a beautiful medium that we as crafters get to use. Uh, it's really, really lovely. It gives your cards real luxuriousness. It does, doesn't it? There is no better time to get some parchment because this is one pound and ninety-nine of your finest pences. It is instead of four pound ninety-nine of your finest pences, uh, and you cannot see fairer than that. So then, let's start putting this together. So we need to get our topper. I'm going to get some tape. We've run out of fingerless tape in here, which I'm very sad about. We need to get that stuck up. Um, if there is any. There where? is some finger lift tape because I saw the boxes, Natalie. Um, the boxes are ginormous. So there's They're like a wall. You can build a wall. 
not Donald Trump's wall, because we don't want to build that wall. We're, uh, we're, we're having a fingerless tape wall and everyone's welcome. Well, yes, well, let's get that tape wall in here, because we need our fingerless tape. So let's stick this directly over the top, making sure that that is... So, guys, we're going to want to know, after this demo, how did Bad Mouth do? Was Natalie... Uh, well prepared, did she do a good job with this demonstration? Do you like the card that she did at the end of it? If you do, then you're going to put free Nat in the comments. That's right, free Nat. But if she did a poor job, you weren't impressed with the card, you don't like her bad mouth, mm -hmm. something went wrong for you, then you're going to put bad mouth. And if Natalie gets too many bad mouths, then guess what? I'm staying here all You're day. staying here all weekend. Weekend? Natalie. No, it's Super Bowl weekend. It's you can't a do that Friday. To me. It's you a Friday. You cannot do that to me. It's Natalie, Super Bowl the amount, of the amount of TVs we've got in here, you can watch Super Bowl, I'm sure. But well, you're, you're yeah, it in would be here. good. I mean, I'm here for Monday morning, so well, I don't have true. to get up. At the minute, people have a beautiful view of your Sorry, hat. sorry, sorry, sorry. I was just it's making sure that hat. I was lining this up um, and getting that nice sort of gold edge around the outside. So then we're going to stick this to... Um, the middle here, making sure that it is the right way round. You're getting some free nuts, Natalie. I will Already? tell you, I have not seen one person say bad mouth yet, and I do not know why, because she has a potty mouth. You guys must not know her like we do. Yeah. That mouth is a potty mouth. Let's hope no friends or family are watching right no, Absolutely, <laughs> they know the real you. Because they will agree with you. Um, Zara Harper says she's never used parchment. Honestly, it's absolutely beautiful, it just Zara. It adds such a touch of class to your cards. Grab it's yourself beautiful. some. beautiful. Okay, so then we need some strips. Let's see what we've got in here. I bet these are all small ones. Shelley says that she buys parchment to use, but because it looks so pretty, she buys it and just seems to collect it. And I, I understand that. Quite it a lot lovely. of people do end up doing that, but you shouldn't because it is so pretty that you just, you have to use it. So I'm adding this corner on raised foam pads. Um, so I'm just getting, let's use this strip for this bit. I'm just putting my foam in place. So I've got um, those along the outside edge and then I'm just going to add another couple just here so it's stuck down on that edge as well. So let's peel these back. There's a lot of people who use, uh, in the comments, who use Kindles. So we talked about Kindles and, and real books now. And there's, mm -hmm. um, there's a real sort of split, a divide of people who love original real books and people who love the Kindles. Kindles are so light. Um, so you won't really know that if you're not a big reader now. There's, there's a thing called a Kindle. Yeah. And you can get other e-readers as well, right? Yeah. And it's got like, um, it's not got a bright sc screen like a tablet. Oh, so it's like dulled, because so that hurts my eyes sometimes. There you go. It's like looking at uh, a newspaper, if that makes sense, okay. right? Uh, and, it's, and, and you turn the page on it just by pressing the, the edge of the screen and the next page comes up. Oh, and obviously useful. you can have... I don't know, probably hundreds of thousands or tens of thousands or many, many, many books in it. Yeah. That makes sense. And you can buy the digital books and when they come out, you can just get them transferred straight to your device. Does oh that my gosh, sense? that's so, that is really useful, isn't it? It's really, really useful. Yeah, we love our Kindles at home. Um, and they're, they're quite a bit lighter than books. Hardback books are gorgeous things. They are, but they can get heavy and sometimes you get them ruined as well, which isn't a nice thing, isn't it? If, yeah, if you spoil it. If it's it, a special book. It's I hate, I do hate that. I do read when I'm on holiday sometimes but it's never normally a book that is of any use it'll be mills and boons won't it mills and boon books what that does, that will mean that nothing is. to you no nope. natalie whatsoever absolutely nothing i bet you doesn't mean anything to you Moving either, on. Does it, <laughs> oh people at home what are we living with here <laughs> it's just not fair is it so i've added my sentiment and as you can see i've picked out the two sort of like little bookmark um pieces here so I'm going to stick these smaller elements on instead of using gemstones um, because we do do these in some of our kits and I really like to, to utilise them. And then I'm hoping in our lovely box of ribbons here, we've got, oh, let's use this. This will work perfectly. We've got this really nice sort of pink colour here. Um, it's kind of like a, it's an org organza ribbon. So it's nice and light, but it's kind of like a rusticky red that you can see in the buttons here. So then I can pick these off and I'm going to actually thread this together 
like so. Natalie, we're getting so many people saying free Nat. Already, this is a good thing. Do you know? People know that I'm a, I'm a good, a good person. A good person. A good person. If they're already wanting to free me before I think I've it's even because finished. they like your card. Um, I'm sure, one hundred percent sure, that all these people believe me when I say that you keep stealing my spurs. Oh yeah, yeah definitely. Because I, I'm the sheriff. Always and people need to remember spurs. that I'm the sheriff around this place. So. That's right, isn't it, Deputy? Correct. Not correct, well, yes. Sarah's just asked when you will be doing some demos again. Oh, well, it will happen. We would love that. It will happen. So, I did, we started doing Honky Dory TV about two years ago, something like that. And after about 18 months, 20 months maybe, I did a demonstration. It took me yes. 18 to 20 months to get ready. <laughs> Um, I practiced and practiced, and then I was ready, um, and I, I've started practicing again, so sometime in 2023... We'll definitely get him back. So there we go, with that wonderful collection, um, we've added some parchment there, you've got the really rustic feel with the L shape, and then you've got those beautiful bookmark toppers, which I think really just fit the feel uh, nicely. So that is just a, a quick little example of what you can be doing with your Just a Note collection. Well, you, uh, it's a very pretty card. Um, you cattle rustling, bar brawling outlaw, um, they are saying, and I, and I can categorically tell you, so far it is free nap. Yay! Uh, let's take another look at that card. That's a very attractive card there. Um, that's side. absolutely lovely. And I, I understand, guys, why you said free nap. We're going to see. She's got three cards to make before three she more. can get this keydom of freedom. Three cards, two more to make, we shall see. Uh, our second product that we're gonna show you today is a back in stock product. This was launched um, earlier on in the year, I think only about three weeks ago, it something like very, that. It was very, very soon. It wasn't a long time ago. It at sold all. out on Creating Craft. And then we got more stock and that sold out on Creating Craft. And we launched it ourselves and that sold out here. All the singles sold out, it is back in stock, guys. It is our beautiful Springtime Wishes decolage, And we're gonna show you a little VT uh, with some beautiful cards and inspiration. Wowzers. It's a beautiful, beautiful collection, this. Uh, our springtime wish is Decolage. Decolage is fabulous. There's something really special about it, isn't it, Bad Mouth? Oh my gosh, yes. It is beautiful. And this one as well, because it's so full of spring things and all those things we're looking forward to in the coming months. It's wonderful. There we go. So with, e with each decolage sheet, this is a decolage sheet. So it's de called decolage because the decoupage is large. It comes foiled, it comes die cut. So all these little sections, and this is how good it is. All of these individual floral blooms here just are all die cut out. for you to press out. They just pop straight out. In the big kit that's $24.99, you get two of every single sheet. Um, and then you get these base layers. So this is your main decoupage topper. And that's what all of those little individual pieces are going to go on to. They get uh, built up from the largest to the smallest. And if you always go largest to the smallest, you can't go wrong in what order to put Most them in. Most definitely cannot. Uh, the sentiments in here, as you can see, there are borders in here as well. Um, gorgeous cardstock. Uh, the mum uh, bookcase there, which is perfect, as you can imagine, for Mother's Day. Uh, or just for happy birthday for your mum, of course. Um, the oh, dog Scotty here. Dogs. I love the artwork in this collection. It's really, it's so really attractive. Cute. So as I say, there's two sheets of each. I will jump through so that you see one sheet of each, um, so that you're seeing different sheets all the time as much as possible. And I love as well with this collection, as we do with all our decolage, if you don't want to use those base layers and you want to save your kit, you can um, de put your decolage straight onto the cardstock. Um, so you're saving those bases so you can just use those as toppers on normal cards or with um, spare papers that you have left over. Uh, it's really, really fantastic. So this is key. The decollage also fits, there we go on this side, also fits the, um, the images on the card blanks. Yes, yep, I, don't, I don't know if it's 100% all of them, 
but most of them. The vast majority, sure. unless, yeah. unless unless we purposefully made a much smaller one. Look at that. The birds are beautiful. It's really attractive, isn't it? So this you can you can see at home. I'm sure why this sold out so quickly uh, on Create and Craft, and then as well with us. Perfect springtime card making. It's called Springtime Wishes. Uh, as you'd expect, gorgeous um, card making for, for throughout spring and indeed into summer as well. Uh, love the rabbits. Uh, great for Easter cards. Um, there you go. The, the, the window basket's really pretty, isn't it? I love that. Uh, Natalie's going to demonstrate with this. I am. Which I is really, lovely. I really like that one that you just shown, actually. When, um, when we were making samples, we did something that's quite cool where we put the layers on top of acetate and then put the base layer behind it. So okay. it gave it even more of that window effect. It was very fun. Now with decolage, you can get things like um, dimensional card bases, oh, yeah. you, which are gorgeous. Uh, if you've not seen those, jump on the website, dimensional card bases, you can get handmade card boxes because obviously you're going to make a card here that is built up 3D, which uh, um, uh, Marie, Natalie will, will show you exactly how to make one and how simple it is. Um, in a minute. There's not only, I mean, I, I've, I could keep going, there's so much in this kit, but we've got so much to get through. £24.99 for all of that decolage you can see there, including the bases, including the cardstock. There's a load of goodies here, it's beautiful. Um, oh, there's also that, can I just show that one? That's in there as well. I love that one, it's so precious. That little cat is just adorable. Absolutely lovely. So you can put as much or as little of the decou decollage on or decoupage on as you want. That is completely up to you. Um, and as, as Natalie says, you can use it throughout your card making. You don't have to just use it with, um, with, uh, with this decollage here. Nope. Uh, we've got insets. There's a bundle, a super bundle. That was, um, what was the price there? On the, on, the, on the bundle? The bundle's 39 97 wow. um, There is, which is, uh, saves a five, five pounds extra on that. Um, there was also, I don't know if the inserts data that we showed there was just the note inserts, um, which was a quid. I think these are three ninety nine. are they? Nine oh, 9 99 9 99 for 36 that's why. Three ninety nine if there's 12 in it. So you can see you've got this sort of watermark effect here with the inserts. Just finish your cards beautifully. Um, that's available as well, and of course that is part of the bundle. All these items back in stock. We have a just have to open this. This is how new this is. Brand spanking uh, is just being shrink wrapped. We shrink wrap as much as we possibly can here at Hunky Dory instead of using the bags. Um, the bags are recyclable, yes, but the shrink wrap is obviously more easily recyclable uh, and could just go in your normal recycling waste. Okay. Um, springtime wishes, gorgeous uh, little book. It's a square little book, so there's 150 pages in here. Uh, utilising all this artwork and other artwork yeah, as well. Yeah, and more. Here you go. It's great though, isn't it? I think everyone loves our little books because they're so versatile. You can make so much with them. Um, look at that bunny. It's just adorable. So you get six of each sheet in here. You do. And it's a real mix of artwork. So the artwork that's used within the kit, but also look at that. That's so, so gorgeous. Nice. Uh, I think spring is such a beautiful time of the year. Um, spring card making is really nice. It's sort of new beginnings, isn't it? Yes, I love that image with the little flowers in the basket. And then you've got some ones with spring animals in. You've got some more floral elements. There's that lovely um, dog from before. Oh, it's just so nice, isn't it? Just makes you want. It makes cat. you want it to be spring already. It does. And you know, I, I, it's, it's going to get colder there. again, I think, isn't it? Yeah, but there's, there's but the temperature is slowly but surely the average temperature is rising. Uh, over here in the UK, anyway, obviously it's different around the, around the world, isn't it? Look at the depth. I mean, that looks like it's already been decoupaged, doesn't it? How pretty. So, can you just put the uh, information for the bundle back on screen, please, Em? Look at the cat there. Okay, so it doesn't say what's in that bundle, which is a shame, but it's... it's oh, here we go. Emily can tell us. So, it's the whole of the, of the decolage um, doubled up, so there's 24 decolage that you get. It's this gorgeous little book. And the user. And it's the inserts together, all saving an extra fiver, $39.97, back in stock. Guys, if you like the decollage but you want to buy singles or individual ones, if you've already had the kit and you want to get more, um, they are now available on the website. You can get the individual Springtime Wishes decollage. Let's go across to Badmouth and see whether she can be freed with her second demo. Oh, I'm excited about this because I love um, doing cards in this particular way with our decollage. So we've got a 7x7 um, card blank and I'm going to use the Amongst the Blossoms which has 
the beautiful birds on there. I'm also going to use some of that cardstock, our, print, our foiled Springtime Wishes cardstock, which we have available for you as well. So we're going to start by cutting this to 7x7 seven seven with our trimmer. So 7x7 seven seven, and then, is that right? Just take a little bit more off there just in case. So 7x7 seven seven, and then with the actual card blank, we're going to cut that down to, um, I think if my, get my mat because I've already chopped that down. So my mat is six and a half. So we're going to cut this down to two notches um, below that, which, yeah, is just there. And then we're going to keep those birds in. So making sure they're on there. We can chop that down as well. So then we have our image here. And I'm actually not going to use my base layer. I might use a border off there, but we're going to just layer our decoupage straight onto here. Which effectively gives you another top of it. Really, use it does. So you can use it in your crafting. Um, it's great for um, making more cards from your kits. So being able to, if you sell your cards, you're going to be able to um, make more, obviously, which is a really good thing. Natalie. We have an anniversary in the house. An anniversary? Abby Williams, congratulations. She says that she's just received a cream tea from her daughter and family for their anniversary. How lovely. How very, very yummy. Oh, I, I hope that, I hope you have like a nice conservatory or something where you can sit there and it's in, in the warmth. Um, yeah, and, but and still And, have, see and with your cream outside. tea on a nice little, they have those... What are they called? I don't know what they are, but they're like a multi-layered plate thing with something in the centre and they put all the cream tea on, around oh, it and bring cake, it... a cake stand. A cake stand, thank you, Nat. A multi-layered thingy. I was like, what? What is it? What? Joy Michelle says that she loves this and she's ordered it for Mother's Day. It is beautiful. Mel Savage says she loves decolage. Uh, she got the Christmas ones just recently. Um, people, people absolutely adore this decolage. We adore it too. It's really, really pretty. Um, I'm hoping to bring you another one back next year, uh, another springtime one at this time of year as well. So then we'll stick that onto our gold mirror and I'm actually going to put this on foam pads just to raise it up off that um, beautiful foiled cardstock that I've selected that matches those birds quite nicely. So we'll peel this all off. like so and I'm actually I want this to be tentfold so we're just gonna stick that directly on there so you've got those that nice little foiling around the edge just to add a little bit something extra um I'm going to use from my base layer I'm going to use this border which has got that floral element on so I'm just going to use my knife just to pick that out because if I start cutting into it then my sheet might get ruined but if I just pick out the element that I want there's then my sheet of, stays intact. There's quite a bit of talk now about um, getting the, to free postage so uh, if you didn't know guys if you are ordering in the UK Mainland UK P and P is only £2.99 that's not £2.99 uh, an item no it's not, it's not where we cap your P&P at six ninety nine or something if you buy three or blah, blah, blah. No, it's £2.99 for your order unless you hit 30 quid. And if you hit £30 after discounts before shipping, you get your shipping free. Ooh. So your post and packing is free over 30 quid here in the UK. We would love to be this able to do that to worldwide. Know, isn't it? Um, but unfortunately we can't. Um, maybe one day, but certainly in the UK. Isn't that brilliant? It is. It is absolutely fantastic. So just get yourself over thirty pounds. It's easy. Soon as you're you get this bundle. Squid. Get the bundle. Throw the bundle in. You're done. Oh, that's true. Actually, yes, the bundle comes with free postage automatically. That's true. Um, guys, uh, let's have a little bit of an update on shipping. So we have been behind, as you can understand. Pound shop was ramajam. It was, it was very so busy. busy in Pound Shop all the way through January. We've had we've launched some incredible products, light products like this that went out of stock. Um, so the guys were under a bit of pressure, but they are making moves. They are. We have weekend workers. We have uh, extended hours for our um, our picking and packing team. Obviously, we're doing everything COVID securely, um, as you would expect. Uh, but we are making major moves. So we reckon. By this time next week, we will be back to 48 hour dispatch. Oh, that's good news. Absolutely. Yeah, that's, that's where, incredible. and then our aim is, that's what we want. Our aim is to stay there. 
you know, what we really want more than anything is to be sending everybody's orders out either same day or next day. Yes, of course. When you do things like the club gift, it, the, the, there's just so many orders, it's impossible to do that. And obviously the club gift came and, and it was already on top of pound shop, so there was a lot going on. Team have been working so well. I have to tell you, I'm the managing director here at Honky Dory. I am so proud of our team and how they've dug in uh, with the volume of orders and yeah. they're, they're managing to, to get those orders out to people safely, but as swiftly as they can. But they hate it themselves when it's... Um, they do, uh, don't uh, they? Uh, they're not happy when they no. can't get those parcels out and they know that they've got lots to do. Absolutely, but we are getting better and better and closer and closer. And our aim is that once we get to that magic 24 to 48 hour dispatch, we're going to stay there. Mm -hmm. I'm really excited about it. And there's some great stuff coming up, isn't there now? some fantastic things and um, it's very very exciting indeed so i'm layering this straight up now onto my um cardstock as you can see so this one goes just up here and then i've got this one that goes at the bottom and you can see the dimension already building on here then i'm gonna just stick this one needs to go on top of my little bird here and then once I've got that stuck together we can just add that to this top part. Now Gemma Bowdry says that she received her club gift yesterday and it's stunning she can't wait to use it. Gemma when you do please do us a favour send us a picture of your makes. Definitely uh, we'd love guys, to see what you're doing with us. We that love stuff. to see your makes we really really do. Um, you can send um, images into studio at hunkydorycrafts.co.uk uh, jump on the hub um, we can put in people can can uh, put images onto the hub can't they? Yeah, yeah, um, can. yeah that's brilliant. Um, so we love to see your goodies um, uh, or what you've done with your goodies should I say. So then my large sentiment, which came from my um, backing sheet, where you've got that topper to build up, that's going to go um, in this bottom corner, or maybe just a bit further up actually. I kind of like the space on either side. And then, so that says, wishing you lots of happiness today and always. And then on your element sheet, you get this beautiful round topper, which says birthday tweetings. Instead of greetings, tweeting. It's very good. Very clever, very clever indeed. So that's just going to go up there like that. Um, I think let's just throw on some silver gems because it's just missing that little something. So three large gemstones in that wonderful silver colour. So it all matches beautifully. We're going to fill that corner just on this side just to give it that extra special something. And then there you go. Natalie, that is another lovely card, and you can see the. Um, Look at how much it stands off there. The dimension's great, it's isn't incredible. it? Incredible. So it makes these cards. Decolage makes these cards lifelike. Can you see? That's perfect. A perfect way to show the accent foiling. It's stunning, isn't it? Just picking up the accent foil, the feathers on those birds. It's really attractive. It's incredible. Okay, can you see people at home why this sold out? Uh, cards like that show you why this sold out. Uh, I want to know, guys, is it free nat? I mean, people are saying, before I've even asked you, people are saying free nat. <laughs> oh, it pays to be an outlaw. I mean, what's that about? Is it free nat? Join the sheriff, someone just said. Oh no, jail the sheriff, Colleen. I we thought should. it said join the sheriff. I think I we should do a little switcheroo. The sheriff should I've, be in I've, here. Yes, it's been asked, it's been mentioned <laughs> earlier on. Okay, so guys, is it free nat or is it bad mouth? Were you happy with that demonstration? Did Natalie do a good demonstration? Did you like the card? Was it, if so, put free Nat uh, in the comments, please do. If not, put bad mouth. I'm not aware that there's been a bad mouth yet today. Oh, this is good news. What is going on? Everyone on YouTube is free Nat. Sorry? Everyone on YouTube is free Nat. I'm loving this. I'm loving the love. This is not fair. People are saying People fab need card. To spread more love. Loving uh, it. Sorry, I've just joined. What size is your lovely card? Do you know what size that was, um, uh, Anne says? Towards the end, the end, towards the end. So it was seven by seven, and then my middle section is six and a half. So seven by seven in total. Perfect. Uh, okay, people at home, there were a couple of other items that are available with that Springtime Wishes collection. Uh, I'm not going to have time to go through them properly, but it's just to let you know there's some stunning Springtime foil card that's really, really attractive. So if you can see the foil, oh, look at that. If you can see the foil designs, 
on this gorgeous foil, um, adorable scoreboard, 350 GSM, look at the springtime colours. What we did with this, we went crazy with all sorts of different, um, different full designs. So it's not just one design used all the way through, look at that. Isn't it beautiful? Some of our best ever designs that we've done, there's some new designs in here, it's a real mix. I'm just gonna go back there because those little, look at that, the little polkas. But you can see the, the foil, how luxurious it is when it's draped across, across cardstock like this. So that's £9.99, there's 24 sheets in there. There are, there's also some adorable scoreable, um, 30 sheets of adorable scoreable springtime wishes in the same colour as, the, as these, so they match perfectly. That's at 9 99 not got time to show you. Um, there's also a gorgeous selection of stamps. Again, I really do apologise. Um, £16 for three sets of stamps. They're normally £8 each, uh, so it's basically three for two there. You can get all three. If you go to the website, um, you'll find in the uh, papercraft section at the top, you'll find one of the most recent collections is Springtime Wishes. Click on that. All of the Springtime Wishes goodies, they're all on there, and I think they're all back in stock unless anything is sold out again. Oof. Um, okay, we are getting very, very close to being able to give Natalie this Kingdom of Freedom. Uh, before we do that, we've got another demonstration that we want to see. We've got another product that we want to see, but I want to remind you about our Win It Weekly promotion. We're getting very, very close now, people. Uh, Woodland Wildlife Topper Collection. Uh, five of these are going to be won today. They're going to be won in about 15 minutes. Um, and it's brilliant, isn't it? So you've got about five to 10 minutes to get your answers, your comments in. What we would like to know is how many cards are sent on Valentine's Day each year? Is it A, 170 million? Is it B, 145 million? Or is it C, 120 million? We're going to give five of those away at the end of the show. We're also going to be spinning the wheel today as well. It's you like exciting. That? It's very exciting. Love spin the wheel. Uh, next product, shall we go? Lots of people saying 145 million. Can I just say, I can see on the iPad here, lots and lots of people. Maybe that is the answer. Emily will tell us at the it's end. It's a lot though, isn't it? It's a lot, 145 million. It's a lot of people. So, so that's on Valentine's Day each day. Is that, that's, that's a year, so that's worldwide, is it? Yeah. I don't yeah. know. Yeah, it is worldwide. Do you know how I know? How do you know? Your mum asked it what the answer to the question was on Monday. And she said, oh yeah, there's not that many people that live in the UK. <laughs> so that's so how this is, So out. is that in the UK? No, no, no there's no, no, of course well, it's not why? in the UK. It's not enough, it's, yes, that makes perfect sense, sorry. <laughs> that's a whole lot of love, isn't it? It is, isn't that's it? That's a whole lot of love. It's what we need right now. It's what we need right now. Um, let me show you, before I do show you these, I'm gonna show you this. I'm going off piste to show oh, you no. something rather exciting. And I've done this on purpose just with it. <laughs> Just, Emily, Emily's just uh, adjusted all the cameras and everything, ready for us to go, but no. No, we're going here. Uh, this is our Starry Galaxies Miri card. woo -hoo -hoo -hoo, look at that! This is our Starry Galaxies Miri card special. Okay, love doing these Miri card specials. It's where we, instead of it just being gold or silver Miri, we do something very, very special. Uh, and it is, uh, this is one of, one of them. We've had Rainbow Radiance, we've had this, and then we have just brought out our Geometric Miri as well. Oh my gosh, Which, so if you've bad. seen it, it's on our Club Hunky Dory uh, gifts page. You can go and find it. It's, it's incredible. amazing, amazing. Uh, but this is Starry Skies. Look at, the, look at the, the skies in here. If I can get it so that it, there you go, so that you can see it beautifully on screen. Um, gorgeous sort of twilight effect. You look up there at the sky and you see this. There are three different colorways in here. Um, as I move through them, you can see, look at all this gorgeous blue um, through to here. Look at the green. Wow, it's like a nebula effect, isn't it? You can't get at home the real wow of this because you're seeing partly the, 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 um, uh, the lights from the cameras, uh, from the TV screens and so on, so on and so forth in here. But if I can get, you can see, when you get it at some angles, it's just wow. Maybe that's better. It's just incredible. And look at this as well, look at the purple. 30 sheets in here in total. A gorgeous Starry Skies Miri card. As a border nap, amazing around oh, your cards. Oh, so beautiful. Sent, quitting your sentiments out, amazing. Yes, exactly. So when you do sentiments, when you do, uh, when you're doing die cutting with this, it's beautiful. It's very different. It's very special. That's why it's a Miri card special. It's eleven ninety nine for thirty sheets. It's a great price as well. That, as long as uh, exactly the same as our Rainbow Radiance, which if you like that Rainbow Radiance, that is coming going short of stock now. So we'd be saying less less than ten percent left. So it's limited stock. Um, if you like that, grab it. This will go the same way. There's probably twenty or so percent of that left. I know because I saw the numbers yesterday. Let's take a look. 
Oh. Duo design time. I was, uh, I, un these. I was unfortunate in that I couldn't see these. When we launched them, I didn't get to um, No, because it was a Saturday, wasn't it? Uh, so who did, did you do the show? I did the launch show. Uh, and I think Rachel did the, the Hoi Kiro TV show. Yeah. Okay, okay. So I've not seen these yet. I've not had any detailed time with these. So I, I want to. And I'm sort of going to learn about them as you guys do. What's special about our Duo Design paper pad? Number one, it's an eight by eight paper pad. Uh, number two, there's 48 sheets in it. Number three, it's double sided, double hence sided. the duo. Duo because on one side you have vintage maps and aged, uh, vintage maps, sorry. On the other side, you have aged paper. Okay, so as you go through the pad on one way, you'll get a certain type of design yeah. or a certain theme. As you go through on the other side, you get another theme. But also a beautiful thing about it is that they coordinate perfectly together. They coordinate perfectly together. So we've not put something, we've not put rabbits and dinosaurs. cars. Rabbits and, or dinosaurs, yes. Rabbits yeah. and dinosaurs together. Rabbits and dinosaurs don't mix. No. They don't. <laughs> they don't. It's carnage. We tried it. It didn't work, honestly. Let's take a look at this one first then. So this is vintage maps and aged paper. Um, wow, look at these vintage maps. There's a disclaimer somewhere, I think. Do, please note, these historic maps may contain outdated references. You have to be careful. Um, uh, we put that there on purpose because even though we checked these, uh, these maps to make yes. sure that there was nothing uh, offensive in them because the world has changed. It's a, a different lot. world. And the world's changed in, in a good way. It's a different world than it was, um, you know, you go back hundreds of years. So some of the names of, of places have changed. Yes. Um, uh, Czechoslovakia became Czech Republic and yes. so on and so forth. There's, there's things like that. Um, uh, but we've been through it and we've done our absolute best to make sure there isn't anything that anyone could find offensive in these. But we've still put that disclaimer there just in case. I think it makes sense. Um, look at the gorgeous Australia. I've never been. Would love to go. Oh, I'd like to go. My, uh, my granddad's brother is in Australia. Okay. Um, and I have some cousins over there, so it would be nice to go. We've, we've met them a few times. I think they've been over here. I think I've only actually met them once. You've got North America, you've got, uh, you've got sort of a worldwide. It's great, isn't it? There's some really sort of like specific maps in here that focus yeah. on certain areas, but then there's some larger ones. There's some like whole world images, which are really nice. But there's just so much fun stuff you can do with maps. We're there just really about there. <laughs> if anybody needs to know where we are, we're just about there. There should be a cross, shouldn't there? Or a little, a little H for Hunky Dory Towers. This is 8x8 eight eight, uh, paper, everyone. This is a coated paper, but it's 150 GSM. There's 48 sheets in here. 12 different designs, and obviously you get four of each. Um, really, really pretty. Now, you're possibly starting oh to God. see the other theme that's in here. Yes. One thing that you can see that I absolutely love is the, how do I do this best, is how they coordinate so beautifully with one another. Mm -hmm. Isn't it's it really absolutely good. lovely? And you get that throughout the whole pad. Um, £9.99 these guys, we've not even talked about the price yet. Three for two. Which I think is lovely so because there, you can mix and match with your paper pads. There are three of these but there will be more in there the future, be. of course. Uh, this is, um, what's it called, the second bit? Aged paper. Mm. So you're, you're talking sort of uh, tea stained? Yes, that's that probably sense? the right word, isn't is that it? the right word? Um, but also what I I'll like about this, this is the texture that you've got. You've got that nice sort of like crumpled up um, aged effect even more than the, the sort of watermarks that you've got on there. It's beautiful. This is probably one of my favourites, not just for card making, but for home decor as well. Maybe you've travelled somewhere um, on a holiday with someone. Maybe um, you have a friend that's really far away. You can make some beautiful frames out of this. You mm. can um, use this to cover um, sort of wooden... Um, I can't think of the word now. Things. Like, yeah, You anything. can use it to cover can wooden cover things. Anything. I was thinking like the little hearts. She's got a bad mouth. The little like grey board hearts that you can buy in craft stores. You can cover it with that and then send it to like maybe your best friend who lives in America or somewhere. Do you know, just to say, maybe we're far apart, but I love you. Ah, <laughs> we are far apart at the minute, bad mouth, but I do love you. Thanks. Maybe that's, there's a secret love between a sheriff and an outlaw. Well, who knows? Uh, moving swiftly along, uh, Duo Designs paper pad. This is the second in our first launch, uh, which has three different paper pads in it. it. This is, and if you know how to sp say this, is it terrazzo or terrazzo? Well, here's the debate. Go on. 
the week before my show, I kept asking Alan, who designed these pads, how it was spelled properly. And we were listening to Google Translate, which is in American English. Yes. So the lady terrazzo. said, Terrazzo. <laughs> so I learned it as Terrazzo. 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 This is why However, we call her Badmouth because she keeps saying Terrazzo to everyone. That is the American pronunciation, and you would probably say Terrazzo if you were English, terrazzo, I reckon. Terrazzo. 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 I don't know. Terrazzo. Does anybody... I'm going with Terrazzo. Will you do us a favour? If you know how to say Terrazzo. Please, I would say Terrazzo. terrazzo. Will That's you what please phonetically said. spell it out to us in the comments? Uh, if but you can, let us know. So again, we've got the same thing, but we've got these 12 double-sided designs. These are really attractive and they're very, very different. Yeah, they're all really different in size and scope, um, but it's something that's very on trend at the moment. Um, it's in vogue, Anne told us. Um, on vogue, and she is very trendy. She is very trendy. She is incredibly trendy, is Anne. But I absolutely love the colorways of some of these. Look at that. They're all super different. They're really fun. You can make some quite simple cards <gasps> with this, but they are striking because of the artwork that you get. Um, and again, the other side that coordinates with each sheet is just an amazing way to easily be able to make cards. Because you know, if I pick that page out, the back side's going to work and I can use that for my mats and layers. It's really different, isn't it? I love this one. It? That's tiny one's just the best. So let's turn this around, our duo design paper pad, and look the other way. So this is a gorgeous speckle. It's so gorgeous. It's splendid. It's splendid. Natalie, there's some splendid colours on this. You can see how well those work together, can't you? It's amazing. Um, it's been very, very well done, very well put together. That's uh, by Alan. Alan is one of... Oh, you've met Alan, you guys. Yeah. Uh, Alan, Alan comes on Hunky Dory TV. We've not had him on for a little while. We, um, we'll get him back for sure. We're definitely getting back. He's busy, busy. But, um, we, oh, there's a Miri launch coming. I wonder whether we can get Ari, uh, Alan out yeah. on that. He's the Miri guy, isn't he? He so is he the Miri guy. But, um, yeah, Alan, Alan is very, very talented. He knows, he knows what coordinates. He knows what goes together and works together. Um, so he's like a, you know, our go-to. Go-to Al. Go-to Al. Go-to Al. Al. Um, he's also quite uh, easy on the eye, is Alan. <laughs> yeah? Allegedly. <laughs> yeah? Not jealous we'll at all. We'll bring him back, for sure. I like that one. It's kind of like a starry night. It is, isn't it? Do you use that with your Galaxy Mirror? And that's just the opposite. So that's like a, a really soft pink, but with white speckles. You might not be able to pick them up uh, on, on screen, but it's absolutely lovely. This is very, very different. Okay, very we, I'll, different. I'll show you the next one because I know I've taken quite a lot of time showing you these, and that's because I like them so much. Um, our third one, here we go, Floral Delights and Watercolour Wash. Well, let's take a look at what we've got. Floral Delights, wow. It's stunning, isn't it? Impact. Got really chic florals in here. The array of different colours is amazing. This is going to be so nice for weddings. Peaches, blues. Oh, it's absolutely amazing. Wow. I know. It's so, oh, it's just lovely. Very, very pretty. Again, 12 different designs, uh, four of each, which means that you can uh, tile them up if you choose to. So if you want them to be larger than 8 by 8 oh, yeah, absolutely just tile them. you can easily do that. Super easy. Um, look at all the different, different, it's just... Veritable bouquets. That one's so cute. I love the oranges in that. Yeah, it's really nice. There's poppies in there, which are really pretty. Can you see the springtime ones? There's ones that will take you through to summer, even into autumn, I'd say. Yeah, definitely with that one, with the darker colours. Look at and that. And this one. That one's so amazing. How attractive. Okay, there's a secret white sheet. That's the other cover. Here we go. Because it's not just floral delights. It's watercolour wash as well. When we launched our first adorable scoreable pattern packs, uh, it's either the first or the second that sold out was actually the watercolour wash. It was, it was. It was. So you've got some, because you've got, um, and it looks it's like watercolour. It's like a linen texture, isn't it? Yeah, it's like a watercolour paper, watercolour card um, uh, textured effect, if that makes sense. Um, but you've got, these work so beautifully. Again, you've got the same thing where, where that works so gorgeously with that. And they are designed to do so. Um, but you do not have to. It's completely up to you. So you've got real different tonal um, uh, changes here as we go through the pad, uh, as well as large changes like that where you jump straight to a different colour. More and more and more. Again, there are 48 sheets in here. These pads, any three for two. So that means it. you get three, all three pads, for £19.98. And they're so useful to use with loads of different things that you'll have around the house or different collections. 
dies, maybe you've got some stamps. Um, it's it's incredible. Um, and the collection that we're going to show next actually works really well with it too. Tell me, I don't know what we're launching, what we're showing next, but t tell me, because I've got some other stuff on the side here yes. that I didn't know we had. Are these in stock? Yeah. yeah, these are in stock and these launch with the paper pad. So they're just other essential items that everyone needs. Right, people, I've been asked for these products. Uh, these two beneath me here, um, and there's a spring version of this as well um, that I've been asked for uh, just recently. Um, I was uh, I was asked by via email by a customer where where are these one of these back in stock they're in stock this is brilliant first parchment uh, it's set parchment essentials mixed colors of parchment and um, it's parchment like you saw before uh, but a, a tone all the way straight through yes. it um, can I open it why not let's do that let's do that I'll just show you a couple of colors and they're really nice as well because obviously if you layer them onto a different cardstock it's darker but yes. if you layer it just normally um, it's lighter so Oops, you can create really lovely things if you're into um pergamano i yes. want to say um it looks stunning running this through your embossing folders incredible because you get that crisp white look from all the bits that are embossed and then the rest of it is that beautiful um sort of tone of color but it's incredible i love using parchment in collections absolutely <laughs> love it I, I thought this is a really good idea, right? Because it's you can a white. Show the black it's and white. white. It's a yeah. white shirt. So I was trying to show how it works, right? And then I realised that it's just like pushing my big fat tummy out. Do you know what I mean? And I need to go on a diet. I've depressed myself there. Uh, can you see how the colour changes as you layer these up as well? Yeah. So, so you can create new colours, different colours or different tones by, by just pieces yeah, together. Absolutely, uh, it's beautiful. You can tear it. Um, you can as uh, you can die cut it if you want. Uh, you can emboss it. You can do all sorts with it. So much you can do with parchment. It's really luxurious. Nine pounds ninety nine, and um, that is a core item. Okay, that my plan for that is that it is in stock forever and a day. Right. Uh, so it means that when you want to come back for it, when you need more, you'll be able to get it and you'll be able to get the same one with the same colours. Let's show you these couple of things. Wowzers, trousers. This, you don't need to go to a, um, to a close-up. Adorable, scorable. A3 is now available. So we've got charcoal, which is black. We've got um, white as well. Uh, 24 sheets of 350 GSM, adorable, scorable, A3 delivered to you. Uh, and it's not crazy delivery prices either as no, well. No. It's 2 dollars in the UK um, for delivery, even though it's A3 stuff, which makes it much bigger boxes and so on. Um, and if you hit 30 quid in the UK, it's free delivery, even free. though it's A3 stuff. Free. Yeah, because that's the key thing. The reason why you don't see so much of this in the marketplace is because of how much it costs to ship it. A, it's very heavy, but B, it's the size. There is also a third set, which is a spring set, a pastel collection that's got six gorgeous pastel colours, the key pastel colours for this time of the year. That's available, and if these two are in stock, is that in stock, M? It is. Um, is there it. something else I'm meant to be showing before I come to you? Don't think so. Okay, let's, let's go across to Natalie it. for demo number three. Okay, so I'm going to do a super funky card now using our Terrazzo um, paper pad. Um, so what I've done is I've got... I've created a 4x8, but I've created that from an 8x8, so then it opens this way, which is really funky. I've chosen three, I've chosen four actually, four different colours here. Um, this is going to be my main page, and then I'm going to use these throughout my card just to make, bring them all together. Um, and I've just picked these based on the colours that are used. So what we're going to do is we're going to lie that really light pink straight onto my card blank. And I have actually just cut off um, the corner here just to add a little bit more to this card. So let's lie this directly onto my card. Stop making sure my head is not in the way. Dawn, I think Dawn might have nailed it. Has she? I would say terrazzo, as the word piazza in Italian is pronounced piazza. Oh, uh, okay. So she's probably got it bang on right. That probably makes sense then, doesn't it? Oh, well done Dawn, and thank you very, very much. Are people loving these these paper pads now. We're just going to trim this top bit off ever so slightly because um, it's just overhanging where I've stuck it down. So that's our base layer. Then with our pink and this darker colour, I'm going to create another little border. So what we're going to do is we're going to cut this down to... I've got a piece of mirror here that is just over so my first sheet which is my main element 
we're going to cut to three by seven. So three by seven. And then I'm going to cut my darker pink to two notches below three and a half and two notches below seven and a half. So that's going to create a really nice border. So I'm going to have this main element that's going to go onto um, my silver mirror like so. And then I'm going to have this one that's going to go underneath, but it's going to take up more space. So it's going to be more prominent. And again, we're going to trim our edges, just one edge with our rounded corner punch. Natalie, Shelley is after the info. She okay. wants the secrets. She wants to know what's going on. Uh, Shelley, we're going to tell you. Uh, are the duo pads going to be something that will always be in stock or once gone, that is it? Let me tell you the plan. So our duo design paper pads, which is what Natalie is demonstrating now, mm -hmm. uh, we'll be launching those every few months. Our aim is to try and hold them in stock for three to six months, okay? Yes. Um, and then slowly but surely, they'll get uh, overtaken by new ones that come out, if that makes sense. The duo tones paper pads, if you've seen those, those are on the same offer as these. Now those are similar in a way to our colour families that we used to do. The yeah. tonal paper pads. Colour However, families? they're fantastic, aren't they? So yeah, you can stamp yeah. on them. Um, colour families pa uh, pads are, are going. So if you want cut any colour families pads, get them because the stock... I, uh, when I say get them, get them week after next, right? If you want any colour families paper pads, get them week after next. There's a hint and tip, okay? Um, but the Duo Tones paper pads will go into the same deal as these. The Duo Tones paper pads we will uh, we're keep in stock for a year or two. Yeah, so they're long, long term because they're so, so... They're sort of cool. They're essential, aren't they? Yes, yeah, yeah. Um, whereas these are a bit more fashion, a bit more, uh, you know, different. So these will come in and out, if that makes sense. So I've added my silver mirror to um, my main piece that I'm using here. And then I've just trimmed it off the edge because it was overhanging slightly. Um, so then we're going to add this down, making sure that that is in line. And then you can see that edge that we've got here is a lot more prominent. And then this is going to stick onto here, like so. So I'm going to do that with my tape. Um, when you are sticking papers down, you can sort sometimes get the, this like rippling effect that you can see here. Um, and that's because I've not added foam pads the whole way across. If you don't want, if you want to avoid that, then you can make sure you're make, adding as much foam as possible. Other than that, just make sure you're adding the tape as close to the edges as possible. Um, and then it will not sort of warp when you've stuck the whole thing down. Everybody at home, uh, you are now not able to enter our Win It Weekly competition for this week anymore. Anymore. Uh, I do apologise. Uh, there will be a new Win It Weekly competition launching next Monday, on next Monday's um, The Craft Show, which is 10 a.m. Uh, I'm not quite sure who's on it, but I do know what's on it, and you're going to like it. Then what I've done from the blue here, um, I've cut out my thanks sentiment, and I've added some silver mirror as well, and that's going to fit over here. I do think, though, that maybe it needs to be on top of something, just to make it stand out. So let's just cut um, this to one and a half. And then I think my sentiment is a little bit bigger, but that's okay because it's going to sort of hang over and create like a nice little effect. I might trim that down even smaller, actually. Let's go for one and a quarter so you've got more of like a, an overhanging look on that. Yeah, that's definitely what we want. So then if I stick this on first, then I'll know where I want to trim it. So I've got some of our really thin foam pad strips just on the back of that sentiment to raise it up. Um, so I've cut it from the blue and then the silver to give it a nice um, shadow effect that you can see here. Then on this side, I'm going to just angle this so that my letters, my K and my T are overhanging. I'm going to take my thingy and hopefully this will fit in. And we're just going to again ooh, trim that edge off so it all fits really nicely together. And then we will add this on with, let's use some of the square 
card. So this is a very different card. It's so different. In comparison it's to the two that you made. Something that made I earlier. probably would make more myself at home. Something that's a bit more funky and fun. Um, but you can make loads of different styles of cards. Um, but I definitely think this one lends itself to that funky, fun atmosphere. So then I'm just going to, because I wanted to make sure it was where I wanted it to be and I didn't want to cut it beforehand, then once that's on there, we're just going to take our scissors and use that backing card um, so you can see where it is. And then I'm just going to leave it like that. I could possibly put some uh, some gemstones on there, but I think I we're think just going to leave it like that. That's really cool. It's really funky. It's really different. Uh, love the fact that you've got the miri layer in there that just, it just makes adds that, that extra something. Terrazzo it? pop. It does, doesn't it? I like the white. Your colours there really work together. So that's and, and three... they're all from the paper pad, which is a really interesting thing to be able to show that no matter what sheet you pick from as your main focus, you're going to be able to get backing sheets that work perfectly with it. I love it. Uh, and that's, that's brilliant. And that's using one of those thanks dies as well, yes, which are uh, available. It's a combo die. Uh, those Moonstone combo dies have a die. They also have stamps that go with them. If I can just grab this one, I'll only be a second. Um, this is ours. So it's been used a little bit. It's very uh, messy. Let me show you this. So there you go. That's a thanks one. But you can see here. So you've got the words so much, you're the best for everything. Just to say you are amazing, heartfelt. So you could put the word heartfelt above the word thanks to create in this section here and to create heartfelt thanks. Does that make sense? So you get the die and you get the stamps as well. Um, combos, they're available on our website, hunkydorycraft.co.uk. Make sure you are in the Hunky Dory Club before you buy anything yes. because you get 5% discount off all full price products immediately just for being part of the club. Uh, it gives you access to Club Hunky Dory, uh, access to the hub. There's loads and loads of information, education on there, inspiration on there, um, uh, loads of stuff, and it's free to join. Uh, you By creating an account, you automatically join and you are in. Uh, okay, we did have another product to show you, but we do not have time. I know, it's so, so, it's just gone so fast, hasn't it? So what this we'll... This is an incredible product, though. I think we should definitely just give it a little flash. I'll give it a second. What we'll do, guys, is we will do a show for you uh, where, we, where we do, where we bring back, later in the month, we'll bring back some of our other items, or indeed we'll get this onto the next roundup. Uh, our wonderful waterfalls, uh, these are also back in stock. So the uh, the wonderful waterfall, waterfall stamping essentials, the white ones so that you can make your own and stamp your own waterfalls, or indeed you can just cover them and create your own waterfalls. These are back in stock at £7.99. Um, so grab them while you can. Uh, wonderful waterfalls still available. Again, this is another one, um, as Shelley asked before, when the stock's gone, it's gone. Wonderful waterfalls will not be, it's been remanufactured once already, believe it or not. And that's, we're in, when did we launch it? Three weeks ago? Less than that. Um, Springtime like... Wishes has been remanufactured re as well. It's frightening how, um, how popular this stuff is. Totally understand some gorgeous stuff. Uh, okay, so uh, Win It Weekly, let's take a little look. Woodland Wildlife, the winners have been chosen. We asked you the question. We said, uh, how many cards are sent on Valentine's Day each year? Is it A, 170 million? Is it B, 145 million? Or is it C, 120 million? Now I have this written down here, I do believe. According to Hallmark, a whopping 145 million Valentine's Day cards are exchanged every February the 14th. This makes Valentine's Day the second biggest holiday for exchanging greetings second? cards after Christmas. That's incredible, isn't it? Isn't that it? amazing? I wonder how many birthday cards. That must be the most, obviously. Yeah, because yeah. if you think there's like thousands of birthdays, millions of birthdays every day. Every, well, everyone there? has one. Exactly. So, yeah. um, Loads. Hunky Dory has two. Uh, we have one for Club Hunky Dory and one for um, Hunky Dory itself, uh, the anniversary of Hunky Dory, so there's two, which is great. Win it weekly winners. So, were you, uh, A, did you get it right? So it was 145 million, which was answer B. Did you get it right? If you did, your name may be one of the five that is about to come up in, on the screen in three, two, one. Congratulations to Denise Pike, you have won. Rebecca Priest, you have won. Congratulations to Stephanie Myatt. Congratulations to Rachel Hannah Grant. And congratulations to Mark Taylor. All of you have won one of these gorgeous Woodland Wildlife uh, kits, topper collections. They will be sent out to you as long as you give us your, uh, your details. We would like you to 
it's got you've got to be really careful with internet safety, oh, haven't you? Now yes. we'll tell you a story in a sec. Um, but we would like you to email studio at hunkydorycrafts.co.uk with your address, uh, or indeed you can message us on Facebook should you choose to. Uh, make sure that you're messaging, messaging Hunky Dory Crafts. Um, word of warning to everyone at home: uh, my friend Natalie um, uh, has been someone tried to usurp her. Yes. Is that my the right word? My identity has been stolen, people. Let's pop across the net and find out. It's important. It is important. So yesterday. Can I just say? We're saying that your identity has been stolen whilst you're wearing a moustache uh, dressed up as a cowgirl. So it's great, it's, it? take this seriously, great. guys. No, it is really seriously. So yesterday, my it was my best friend, actually, who sent it me first. Um, she said, Nat, I've received this uh, friend request from you, I, but it, I don't think it is you. Will you check? So I had a look, and it, it definitely wasn't me. Um, but then about 10 minutes later, it came to my attention through lots of lovely people who watch the show um, and who like my page that um, this friend request had been sent to many people who also like my page um, on Facebook. Um, but not only that, the page was then sending you a message asking you to enter a competition. Um, you had to enter details, including bank details, which is always a no-no and that is something I would never ever ever do um, obviously um, my page is a page so I can't send requests out like that um, for a start and secondly um, all of the competitions are all like share and comment they're never anything where we would ask you to give um, details like that so if you do get a friend request from this person block them straight away obviously we've reported crazy. it to Facebook so um, they will be working their way to, to block in that Hopefully. as well but it's very true, Hunky Dory will never ever ask you uh, for, for those sort of details. Okay, so please um, don't, and that's why we always say never put your address details in the comments yes. if you win. It's very important. Okay, are you ready for us to spin that wheel? Spin the wheel, guys. We do this every single Friday and absolutely love it. So once we've given away our Win It Weekly uh, uh, product to our winners, um, people who haven't won, won it weekly, we give them another chance, won it weekly, where we give them another chance to win something <laughs> by spinning the wheel. Um, this is our awesome wheel. It's going to get updated at some point soon as well. Every now and then we update it with new products yeah, on it. Yeah, let's add some new bits. Let's do that. Uh, but here, we're going to spin it. One person's going to win, right? You're either going to win a prize rollover every week. We Every show we put something into the we prize do, rollover, we do. don't we? So it's getting big, you know. It's getting, it's, and we love it. It just gets bigger and bigger and bigger. And then one person wins that prize rollover and they win everything in it, which is fantastic. So if it lands on that, you're going to win the prize rollover. Um, I don't know what it's up to now, but it's in the hundreds again 200 quid. 200 quid's worth of goodies again already wow. um shimmer gemstones on here there's the adorable scoreable pattern packs uh, there's premier craft tools there's a 25 pound voucher um, some craft markers uh, topper collection of your choice that you choose from the website a uh, moonstone die of your choice that you choose from the website an adhesives bundle a 50 pound voucher to spend on anything you want on hunky dory nice uh, Little Books Bundle, uh, Prism Glimmer Mist, uh, Miri Mega Buy, £10 voucher. There's so much stuff here. Let me put that in the right place. There we go. Are you ready? Let's spin it. When I spin this, you have to comment. You have a minute to comment. You can comment absolutely anything that you want. You can. But what I really, really, really want to know more than anything is whether or not Natalie should be given the Keydom of Freedom. Have her demonstrations been good enough to get the outlaw, no, commonly known as Natalie Badmouth Mossprat, out of that demonstration station jail for the weekend? Is she allowed to go out, do more brawling in the bars? You choose. <laughs> Please, you there's going to be lots of brawling in our bar this week. So weekend. it's either free Nat or it's bad mouth. That's what I want you to comment. Let's see what we're going to win. Not a bad spin. Oh, it's a topper collection. Oh. Oh, what? That's a really good prize. The winner of this prize can choose any topper collection. So it's called a topper collection. You'll know it's a topper collection because the code will end 101. They all, uh, the codes are very clever. They, they yeah. like that. So the code, the code will end 101. Any topper collection on our whole website, you will be able to choose. How and exciting. it will be free sent to you. Okay. Uh, please be commenting either free nat or bad mouth, you choose. Um, and while you're doing that, then Emily will, will flick her mouse and wherever she lands, that person is the winner. So it's totally, um, uh, it, it's, it's by luck. 
Okay. Should I go through the bits and bobs for the weekend? Let's do that, Nat. Okay, so this weekend and tomorrow exactly, we have a fantastic new adorable scorable pattern packs launching um, along with an incredible range of new little books and some dies for you um, so that is going to be this Saturday so tomorrow morning at 11.15 and 2.15 Sheila's going to be down there so we know that the demonstrations are going to be incredible um, I'm super excited for that so make sure you tune in in the morning and that's on Creating Craft TV on Creating Craft TV yeah the lovely Creating Craft um, we're adding the Moonstone Sentiment die set so what have you got here we go let's Ooh. add this all we need is each other hey how lovely is that, that so that's a Moonstone die that. That's being added to the product rollover. And I think that's it for all the bits and bobs. Is that us? Our next Facebook live show will be Monday the 8th of February yep. at 10 a.m. Um, and we're going to be showing off some three brand new little books. That's very exciting. You're going to love Rachel, them. So it's going to be lots of fun. Do we know who's on? Me and Rach. It's Natalie and Rachel. If indeed. Well, Natalie might be here anyway. What do you think? Uh, okay, oh. Emily, tell us, have people said free nat or have they said bad mouth it's all been free nat Yay! Oh! <laughs> again i'm gonna get out of this costume but i'm thinking of keeping the tash on all day she's a rooting <laughs> tooting outlaw everyone what are you doing that is a good look actually i'll give you that natalie that is a good uh, it's look. great you know my dad sits at home and he just sits on the sofa, whatever he's doing, watching TV, you might do this, I'm not sure, it might Go be on. a moustache thing. But he sits there and he plays with his moustache oh, like yeah. this. When I grow my beard, oh. I do the exact same thing. So I'm getting the vibe of why he does it. Oh, right, okay. It's great. As, as bloat, stash. it's fantastic. Has he got a, has he got a decent beard? Oh, has he got a bit of hair? full on. Get, if your man's got some hair, get him to do this, right? So instead it's, of, uh, normally, oh blokes God, do this yeah. and put the hair that way, right? Get him to comb it that way, it's yeah? Hilarious. It comes out like a lion. Honestly, it's, so it's hilarious. It's so, so funny. When it's um, super long, he yeah. does look homeless it's when brilliant. he does that. Does he? But yeah, Very I'm, cute. I'm getting the, uh, getting the, the vibes of your moustache. Okay, people, so somebody who has commented with the words free Nat, because that's what's happened, which means that she is going to get this Kingdom of Freedom, is now going to win that lovely topper collection. Emily, have you chosen? Yeah, the winner is Liz Mills. Liz Mills, you have won a topper collection of your choice from the Hunky Dory website. Any, uh, any collection that ends 101, congratulations to you. Commiserations to everybody else. Remember that we will be spinning the wheel next Friday. We'll also be doing our Win It Weekly uh, starting Monday at 10 a.m. Uh, Natalie, yeah. Badmouth Muss Pratt, socially distanced, congratulations. Thank you. She's free again. Thank you, everyone, for voting. Until next time, we have to round her up. For the roundup. Uh, I want to say thank you very much for spending time with us today. Uh, it's a goodbye from Sheriff Dan, a goodbye from Deputy Emily Ralph. Bye. And it's a goodbye from Natalie Badmouth Musprat. Goodbye. <laughs>